The improvement of battery technology helps global car makers to accelerate their pace to go electric. In wintry conditions, an electric car's driving range could be cut by half. Why is that? Because the battery is not fully charged or discharged, leading to a decrease in electricity capacity as a whole. Uh such cold resistant batteries have been favored by Photon, BAIC Motor, Bao Group, and other EV makers. They have also been equipped in a fleet of hydrogen powered buses providing commuting services during the Beijing 2022 Olympic Winter Games. At an average minus 20 degrees Celsius, the temperature in the bus cabin rises by 5 to 7 degrees Celsius per minute. In about 5 minutes, the batteries can resume their charging speed just as on summer days. According to Mao, a 100 kilowatt hour battery pack only consumes 1.7 kilowatt hour to raise the temperature by 10 degrees Celsius. For Mao and his team, it was a hard won battle to improve the performance of batteries in the freezing weather. We had researched a lot, from materials to the renovation of the electrode, and even the additive for the electrolyte. Some achievements were made, but no ideal solution was found. We have been struggling to find some better solutions. Later we contacted Professor Wang Chaoyang, a Chinese-American scientist. His team offered a solution of adding a heating sheet to the battery. Based on such a solution, we made some adaptions to use the sandwich structure to improve the speed of battery heating. In 2021, sales of new energy vehicles in China went up by 160% year-on-year to 3.52 million units, ranking first worldwide for seven consecutive years. Such momentum continued in the first quarter of 2022 when the Chinese new energy vehicle market posted a 140% year-on-year growth. The boom of new energy vehicles in China has helped the lithium-ion EV battery industry get on board an express train, an encouraging trend that has heartened Mao. In the early days of EV battery making, we had to conduct battery testing on refitted vehicles as no car makers would like to offer us vehicles for battery testing. In recent years, battery technology innovation has been gaining speed, these inventions have made EV cars dead up in the race against the gasoline-powered cars. These battery cells are for electric aircraft made by Liaoning Ruixiang General Aviation Company, Limited. They have a relatively higher energy density. Besides developing products, we also set the standard for electric aircraft batteries along with the Shenyang Aerospace University. The output in the first quarter of 2022 increased by 40% year-on-year, that is expected to be doubled in the second quarter. Orders are ballooning, but production has been scaled back as the pandemic has disrupted the supply chain and caused a shortage of raw materials. We've coordinated with logistics companies and suppliers in advance and stockpiled raw materials in case of emergencies. At present, 90% of the staff are living inside the factory, while the remaining 10% are living nearby. All of them dine in the factory. In this regard, the company provides reliable support. Local government responds quickly by coordinating epidemic prevention and control efforts in the industrial park, addressing difficulties faced by the enterprises. We have made great efforts in assisting enterprises in the recruitment. We invited colleges to coordinate with enterprises to supplement talent. Rai Sun MGL employed about 860 workers last year. After four rounds of recruitment from March to April this year, 
the number of workers reached about 1,200, enabling the enterprise to open two new production lines. We are exploring building an industrial chain inside the park, so that they can pair up as suppliers and buyers. At the same time, we are introducing a slew of new projects. We try to beef up the battery industrial chain in Baudi by forging, mending, and strengthening connections between these projects.